Welcome to Invite English Family. Hello, I'm Jack speaking. I reached home. Oh. Hi, honey. When did you reach home? Just a short while ago. And I just came out of the house to speak with you. Okay. You know, honey? When I was coming home, I was thinking about you on the way. Wow, really? Absolutely, Jack. Wherever I look, you are the only one I see. I can't live without you, Jack. I'm really happy. I can talk to you whenever I like. There is a cold breeze here. Is it there? For that, I'm not outside. I'm in the room. Then look through that window. There will be nice cool breeze. Yeah. A small breeze. Do you feel cold? Hmm. Shall I come there? The breeze is flowing very slow, right? Where will you meet me tomorrow? I want to see you. Well, I'll meet you in the Rajori Garden. Tomorrow at 11 o'clock. All right, honey. We'll meet there. Have a good night, honey. Good night, honey. I love you. He slept very early today. Who is calling at this time? What are you doing, honey? I can't sleep without you. Please come to me. We'll sleep together. Hey, uncle. Why are you not talking to me? Okay, I understood. Maybe Luna's sister is next to you. That's why you are not saying anything. All the shirts are matching you well, Jack. You just kept it away for some time. From today onwards, you wear full sleeves only. What happened? Hey, nothing. Even though you didn't cut your hair. Bath. Day by day, you becoming very young. Mentally and physically. Excellent young man. Jack. You leaving without eating breakfast. Take a seat. Jenny Auntie didn't make this. I woke up in the morning and made your favorite breakfast. So you must eat. Sometimes even Jilly can make good things. I realized it. Can I ask you something? Hmm. How much do you like me, Jack? Why are you asking me like this? It's been two, three days in the sleep. You are telling that you love me so much. That's why I asked. Is that only in dreams or else? Do you really love me in real life? What happened to you, Luna? Why are you talking to me like this today? Hey, nothing. Because I'm happy. 
You are loving me so much, isn't it? Did Justin have breakfast? Yes, he had. He is ready. Let's go, Dad. I'm ready. I don't know, Dad. He's mumbling something in his sleep. He's not eating well. I'm not sure if he's going to work or not. You should have settled things in the right way. He didn't hide anything from you, isn't it? Then why he is like this? I don't know. But sometimes, he loves me a lot. That time I think, why I am getting tensed. But that is not the thing. Even your parents do not have the opportunity to advise you in your life. Because you guys get each other so much. Do you know clearly what happened between you both? You just pretend that you don't know. Tell me the truth. Nothing is there, Dad. His character had changed a lot. That's what I asked? What's the reason, honey? You know the reason. Dad, I doubt Jack have an affair with the girl. Which girl? You saw a girl that day. That girl, Julie. Is that only your doubt? Or? It's not a doubt, Dad. It's true. <laughs> Don't cry, honey. In his sleep. He is talking about her only. He's hurrying to drop Justin at school. Because he can meet that girl there. Now he had written her name on his hand. I can't understand anything, Dad. As you mentioned, Jack has changed massively. What happened to him? I had previously warned you that stay away from that girl. But you didn't listen to me. I'm not accusing you, honey. She was like my daughter to me. That's all for you. But Jack might not have thought so. You are not that girl's mother in her mind. Things may not go as planned. Even his own son will not do what is right. We should not grant others freedom in our home. Dad, what will I do now? Be cool, honey. Use your brain. There is no point in blaming Jack or that girl. You just think. Who invited her here and give freedom up to the bedroom? Don't worry, dear. I'll call him later. Honey, it's your own life. You should be very careful. If you liked our episode, please like and subscribe to our channel.